everybody. Welcome back to Reviews with Moose. Uh, today I got something in the mail that I've been waiting on since the uh, release date. Uh, finally, it was September 20th. Uh, I wasn't home for the first attempts of a delivery, and UPS wouldn't leave it at the door without signature. Uh, but most of you know that ones that follow me along my weight loss journey, uh, I decided to get a new little toy to help me uh, see my numbers as far as my heart rate. And I got the new Apple Watch 10. I got the 46 inch, uh, or 46 millimeter uh, watch. And I just got it in, so I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and do a quick review on it. Uh, I'm, I'm a little dumb when it comes to this kind of stuff, so I, I mean, if anybody wants to leave me in some comments on uh, how to get more acclimated to, with this device, uh, I'm sure I'm not gonna know how to use it to its full capabilities right away. So any kind of uh, help or assistance in the comments would be great. So let's go ahead and get this thing opened up. All right, so here it is, the Apple Watch Series 10. Let's go ahead and uh, get this thing open here. All right, I got that here. This is one of the bands that I got, and this is the watch. We'll go ahead and open up this band first. There is the band. I thought I had ordered black, but this looks more of a bluish color, but we'll figure it out. All right, there it is there. This will give me the instructions how to do it. And then let's go ahead and open up the beast here. Now, I'm kind of glad I went with the 46 millimeter one. The, I had one, I had the very first Apple Watch, uh, and that's actually the one I'm replacing. Haven't worn it in a few in a while as that was a little bit smaller screen. I'm glad they came out with a bigger screen with the uh, Series 10 rather than having to get the Ultra. So let's go ahead and uh, start getting this open here. This must be the charger. Yep, it sure is. Oh, it's got a USB 3C or a USB-C. All right, I guess we're just going to start tearing things open here. Come on. There we go. All right, there's that, and then we have the watch. How does this come open? 46 millimeter, and I guess this slides out somehow. I got this in there pretty good. I don't think I'm doing it right, but we'll find out. Came out a little bit, there we go. I'm gonna be like that guy in the commercials is breaks it before he, before he even puts it on. All right, I already turned on. And then one thing I did purchase on the uh, on Amazon is a little protector for it. So I'm going to go ahead and put it in as protector here. Uh, just in case if I do any kind of, uh, I do walk a lot, and I might ding it up against something. But we'll go ahead and get that in there. So there's that. Looks like it's starting to set up. It says bring my Apple Watch closer or my iPhone closer. I'm currently on that. So we will do all that set up here in a little bit. But I'm going to go ahead and put this band on as well. Shows here that I'm supposed to be putting it through here. Right, so it goes like this. Maybe this way. Maybe I wasn't supposed to put this on there yet. Maybe this doesn't fit it. Let's try this one. Next one. Here we go. There. I had it backwards. All right. There's that one. And then this part goes over to here. How the hell does this work? Huh. Oh. This part slides into there. There we go. Now we're cooking with gas. All right, so let's go see what this looks like on the wrist. A lot larger than the uh, previous one I had. That is my on my wrist here. And like I said, I'm getting this watch. I uh, wanted to show, like, I have lost a total of... 170 pounds just about i started off at 385 i'm now at uh 217 so that is what it looks like here on me and then we're going to pause it here for a moment and i'll come right back i'm going to uh, activate it and everything all right so we got it all set up now we're going to go ahead and uh, do a little bit of a step up here our startup start take a tour because i don't know what i'm doing 
Learn to navigate your Apple Watch. Let's go ahead and uh, take this off a little bit here. So I can hold this in my hand. It's a little bit easier to do it this way. All right, so let's go ahead here. Press the digital, nope. All right, so it says press the digital crown to see your apps. Okay, here is my, uh, press the digital crown to watch your watch face. Okay, you almost had it. Oh, what do I do here? Now slide this way. Hmm. Wow. Press the button on the side to open up the, oh, there's a button here. Aha. Wi-Fi 84%. Press the side button to close the card center. Okay. This is a nice little tutorial. Turn the digital crown to see your widgets. All right. Welcome to Apple Watch. Enable the Apple card is added. Well, I added my Apple card. I guess that's a positive. Turn on location settings. Location's turned on. I'm guessing that's the way it's supposed to be. And find my network. I didn't find my network. Let you locate this Apple Watch when it's even offline. We'll turn that on because there's probably a good chance I'm going to have to probably forget that. That's in your paired iPhone. This feature requires additional settings. Okay. We'll just hit okay for that. I guess we'll have to do that later. All right. So it's going to go back. Microphone health, motion. Well, again, this is where I'm going to have to rely on you guys to help me out with this stuff here. All right. So we got this. So if I hit this button, it should show my apps up. There we go. And uh, where's Shazam? I didn't know I even had Shazam. The Apple remote. All right. So this is, oh, nope, oh, doing something wrong. This is going to take some time to get used to. Oh, hit this button again here. All right, so we got the apps. I guess that's all set up. And uh, what's this little heart thing do? Audiobooks. Nope. Nope. Hit that button again. This one. Heart rate monitor. Select next. View your history in your next. Let's go ahead and put it on real quick to see what it's measuring. Oh, it's going to have me enter my code again, isn't it? Yep. As you can see, I'm a novice at this. So any kind of help in those comments to help me set this stuff a little bit easier, that'd be great. Be fantastic. All right, let's go ahead and hit this heart again. Measuring, measuring. Let's see what it shows my heartbeat is at. 75 beats per minute. Let me know if that's a, a good beats per minute. Up 72 beats per minute. What's the other one? Heart rate. 68 to 75. I have to Google that and see what that means. Heart rate. All right, let's go ahead and go to the next ones here. Egg on it. Let's do this one. What does this one do? Set up ECG in your... Okay, that sounds like something I have to do on my phone. Uh, what is this little bed thing? Sleep stages. Hmm. Huh. All right, it's a lot of trial and error, it looks like, to figure out all these what these mean. Decibels, that's my voice. That doesn't matter. Let's see if it shows the Apple Music up here. Apple Music. Oh, you even got my playlist on here. Let's go ahead and play it. That's actually a pretty good speaker. Wow. That actually sounds pretty good. Let's go to the next one. Got my feel good music to play last time here. Let's see, a week. No, yeah, that is pretty nice. That actually plays, that's a pretty good speaker on this watch. All right, let's go to the next playlist. See how does that work? Oh, we'll go to old school rap for a second. Oh, yeah. LL Rock the Bells. That looks cool. I am glad that is a that was an option in series one. Oh, and can't forget about Slick Rick. Yeah, that's great. That is cool. That is a pretty neat. Watch, I'll probably use this more than anything else. Let's see what else we got here. Right, go back. 
back. Library. Playlists. Yeah, that's where all my playlists are. That's pretty cool. Let's play a little bit of Dropout Kings here. What was this one? Yeah! I am ready to work out now. Pretty cool. Right, let's go ahead and close this out. All right, so that is pretty neat. I'm glad you can play the Apple Music through this now. Let's see what else we got here. Let's go ahead and go back to the home button. I uh, got the maps. Uh, a lot of this stuff I'm going to have to just trial and error to push the buttons to see what they mean. Uh, one thing I don't see my wife's, I don't see the Tesla app on here. That's got to be on here somewhere. Well, anyway, but that is the gist of it there. I mean, I'm sure it's going to take me a lot of uh, a lot of learning here. But I'm going back to the regular camera here. All right, so I got the Apple Watch set up. Really nice looking on my wrist here. Nice and large. Kind of fits my figure a little bit more. But it's pretty good size. Nice looking watch all together. Like I said, that is that is really nice. It's going to take me a little bit of a while to get used to, but like I said, the uh, this is more or less a gift for me. To, uh, like I said, I've lost... Uh, I started off at 385. I am at 217 now. So that's uh, quite a bit of weight loss. I've, I've still got a little ways to go. I'm trying to get down to the 180s. And this is just a little bit more to keep me uh, track of my... Uh, progress that I got going on so this is uh, the reason why I purchased this was there uh, just with a little bit more health information on your heart rate and uh, I guess there's some more features that are going to be coming out but like I said if anybody has any tips for me on this I'll leave them in the comments uh, as I said, I'm a novice when it comes to this and uh, any little uh, bit of uh, hints and helps would uh, definitely help me out but again this is reviews moves thanks for tuning in for this uh, Apple Watch 10 review our open box uh, and not review because I don't know what to do to review it, but it's pretty cool. All right, everybody have a great day. Thanks for tuning in. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and have a good one.